with that and it's a drama film adventure and it's kind of fantasy movie all right this film is very very personal to me it has my heart and soul and it's very very special movie to me because uh, as you know i've produced it and i'm playing a girl Meyer. Uh, she has a lot of personal crisis and she has uh, depression and uh, it's a very interesting role i think as of now from all my films that's my favorite so maya she kind of reached a point in life when she is not excited to live anymore and she is looking for something which can excite her and she commits suicide but she wakes up in life in some uh, different reality where she meets different characters who takes her on a journey so that's when it. you listen to this script what the first reaction, uh, you know, I wanted to produce a film and I was looking for a script which would really, really excite me that much that I would give 100% to work on it. And I did her in uh, another film and I really like his style of working. So he narrated me one script which I uh, really, really liked, but I had certain ideas about the plot and we started working with him. So eventually we got what we got and um, the script, the final script of the dead end, it's a little bit different from what I got in the beginning, but it was that script which excited me and inspired me to produce a movie myself. So that's uh, how it happened. What made you come in India? Uh, what made you come in India and what, and what attracted you in Hollywood? You know, I love India a lot. In fact, I consider India and Mumbai to be my home because I spent here a lot of a lot of years, almost 14 years. I lived in Bombay, and uh, you know, I was always fascinated about India in terms of culture, spirituality. That was my uh, main priority. And when I moved to Bombay, I was. Uh, quite young <laughs> i'm still young but still i was really really young that time and it was quite a long journey to be where i am now i did mainly the role in the film gel which won national award and uh, eventually i came to the that end and produced it as a baby you were produced and after how was difficulty in uh, <laughs> you know, the journey of this film was, in one way, it was really tough, but in another way, it was extremely exciting, and uh, it was like, I had a lot of, of course, issues, it was not easy, but in the same time, it was like, I was so passionate about the project, and it was giving me a lot of energy to face all the obstacles which I was facing. It was pretty tough because I had around 50 people crew and they were all men <laughs> and when we were shooting in Himalayas you know like it was pretty tough because it's quite hilly area and uh, to carry all equipment and uh, <laughs> uh, uh, yeah you know it's a festival film and as of now I'm quite happy with the result of the film because last year a movie was officially selected in the world Film Festival in San Francisco, in America. Got really good reviews over there. And this year, the movie got award as the best international film in International Film Festival in Rajasthan in Jaipur. So I think we got pretty good results even today, and that's why, our, you know, we are here now to watch the film, and um, people can watch this movie here in October in our digital platforms. Thank you. The name of the film is <clears throat> and uh, the language of the film is English. The film has already won a lot of international awards in film festivals abroad and uh, as well as in India. So today we are having a screening uh, for media and some close friends because the film has not been shown to any media in Mumbai. So we are having this special screening. And uh, it's, a, it's a different kind of film. It deals with existential angst. And it's the story of a girl who's going to commit suicide. And how her life changes when she meets a man who's suffering from a mental disease where he thinks that he's dead. How this, as she meets this man, she meets a criminal, she 
meets a monk. So what all goes through her life? selection at San Francisco Worldwide Film Festival that film got Best Critics Award at Rajasthan International Film Festival and now it's also the Film Festival also. film uh, which people should appreciate because uh, to tell you very frankly today everyone everyone faces a dead end in their life everyone faces a dead end in their life there is an existential crisis in everyone's life so the film gives about through life and how to, how to do Uh, uh, I mean, you most most people are newcomers. You are trying to say, yeah. Um, as you know, uh, the actor and producer Saida, she has done a national award-winning film Jal. Uh, I have also acted in a couple of uh, Hindi films before this, like Bandook, and uh, my recently released film Alif, which got good critical acclaim. So I have tried to work with good actors in the film rather than uh, you know known faces because it was much more easier for me. And it is difficult for stars and all to work in every kind of film today. It has become really very difficult. Thank you.